AFTV, we've got Matty here from um, the Magpie channel. Matty, um, Newcastle, I don't know, they, they, they battled in there tonight, but no real chances from Newcastle today. Just travelled 300 miles, mate, so you one shot on target <laughs> on, a, on a Monday night. So it's 11 o'clock at night now, mate, what's going on? You just came back from the pie, did you, did you see any Newcastle players out there? <laughs> Jesus Christ, I think they're already on holiday. We're seven points clear of the relegation zone, but they're going on like we've, we've stayed up already. They're just season's finished for us by the looks of it. The players are just already on the beach, already think they're safe. We're still, I mean, one more win will probably do it. Mm. But come on, man, you kind of travelled here all the way here on a Monday night and put in a performance out. I mean, it was a bit negative, wasn't it? I was, I was, because it was, I, I, I always thought that you know Newcastle were going to come make it really, really difficult. You've been doing that a lot this season, but. I was expecting more of an attacking threat through you know, recent games I've seen with like Rondon, Ayosa Perez, you got Almer on there, but everybody just seems to be in a defensive shape the whole game. Yeah, I mean, that's what, that's what it is. We've been scoring a few goals late. Obviously, you came back 2 0 down against Everton, 3 yeah. 2 win. Rondon, Almiron, and Perez have been brilliant. Three amigos up top, but where were the day? Rondon turned into Shaw Lamiobi. Almiron was trying his best, but he was running into brick walls. Perez, he may as well not even be here. He may as well stay in Newcastle, didn't do absolutely anything. And just like the rest, lads, I mean, not one of them there can show, hold their hands up high. And not, not many of them came over and clapped off the pitch either, which shows they knew they were disappointed in that form this night. They didn't turn up. We've been on good run, good run of form lately. The break hasn't probably helped. And like you say, the, they just haven't turned up at all there. They think that they're already thinking, feet on the beach, think they're safe. It's just too early to be going on. You're, like you're that. safe, though, isn't it? You, you, you ain't going down seven, this Seven season. points clear. Seven points clear, yeah. probably. Uh, we've got some big games coming up at home Palace, uh, Brighton, Southampton. So. We should stay up, no doubt about that, but they've still got to put on a performance the night, you know what I mean? Coming all the way down here on a Monday night, they've still got to put a shift in. And we didn't expect anything. I said we'd get beaten the night, but it's how you get beaten it. You've got to put in a performance, you've got to put in a yeah. shift for the travelling fans. And let's like say one shot on target, mate. It's absolutely pathetic. And what did you make at Arsenal? You didn't have to get out of second gear, did you? Absolutely mm. cruised that. You didn't have to do anything. Two good goals, good finish by uh, Ramsey for the first one. Yedlin was poor, got caught out, sloppy again out of position. Uh, Lacazette, really good finish. Chipped, mm. chipped to Brafka, but again, the cells are slow. It's very slow to it. But yeah, I mean, I don't know. I think he's, he didn't really have to try. Mm. And that, that says a lot as well. You know, you know me, mate. I'd, I'd rate Arsenal as a, as a good team, especially for where he is on now, third in the league. Very good. You're always going to do that over the Spurs bottle jobs, aren't you? You'll always get out of the third, no, blah, blah, blah. blah. But uh, I think he's will do well. I think Emery's looking like a good manager. Got mm. a couple of signs in the summer, and he's, he's going to really push for it next mm. year. And Rafa, Rafa will stay, you reckon? Ooh, I, I, heard, I heard them saying, uh, I heard somebody uh, who's like a Newcastle reporter saying today that he's heard the inside information that Rafa's definitely going to stay. Do you think that'd be a big boost, Hugo? Uh, well, we, we were on um, Sky Sports the other day and Keith Downey was saying he thinks Rafa's going to stay. Mm. But I won't believe it until it comes out legit. Because, like, I mean, why would you? Broken promises, where I might make actually every year. This was a man who's won the Champions League. He just won a fight for 17th every year. He wants to be competing with the likes mm. of Arsenal, top, uh, even top six, top eight. Mm. That's all we expect. You know, he managed to get a championship side at 10th place last year. He just wants a bit of ambition, a bit of signings. He finally gave it without me on, finally broke my own record in mm. January there. So we need a few more players like that just to make sure we're not just scraping relegation every year because it's, it's not what this club deserves. Mm. And Matt, you know what, finally, before you, before you go, right, just so that people, because a lot, a lot of people will watch a game on TV, <coughs> they'll see this game tonight and they'll see like Arsenal, maybe an Arsenal fan. Just explain to me, if you're a Newcastle fan now, going back to Newcastle, what time will a Newcastle fan get home? Four o'clock of the lucky. Four o'clock of the lucky. Yeah, the last, I think the last stream was about 11, half 11. The buses will take about six, seven hours. And just think after that, it's a good job of like the big beer in it. <laughs> and your end was sold out as usual. And uh, it's crazy, not on a Monday night. People having to take half days, probably days off work tomorrow. It just shows the dedication. It's a shame we haven't got to own that and match that ambition. I just want to say something to Robbie Wright. Mm. You've done more for football, mate, than Harry Kane. You should be. You should. <laughs> you, 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 you should be knighted instead of him, I. And Kane should have squared it still at the World Cup. Eh? <laughs>